Good Thursday evening. Debates on COVID-19 vaccine mandates within law enforcement departments continues. Near Kern, L.A. County Sheriff Alex Villanueva has declined to enforce the county's mandate among his department, and now county officials are taking action there. This week, the Board of Supervisors approved a proposal that gives county officers the power to override the sheriff's decisions and discipline employees who fail to comply. This could lead to the firing of 4,000 unvaccinated deputies in L.A. County alone. 23 ABC's Taylor Levesque joins us live to explain how the Kern County Sheriff's Office is hoping to provide a solution that benefits both their department and law enforcement employees who are fired for not getting vaccinated. Taylor. Kern County Sheriff's Office does not enforce a vaccine mandate, but what the difficulties law enforcement agencies are having over hiring, the department is hoping to take advantage of the thousands of law enforcement officers who may soon be unemployed. Recognizing the LA County mandate debate and highlighting what Kern County has to offer, KCSO and the county are using social media to find the officers they are in desperate need for. There are vacancies and there are too many vacancies. But Kern County Chief Administrative Officer Ryan Alsop says the department isn't just recruiting in California. They are looking to hire officers from around the country. We're not placing or basing employment decisions on vaccination status. We never have. Um, and uh, Los Angeles is and it, that just is what it is. And uh, uh, this is just really part of a, a broader effort to really leave nothing on the table uh, in our recruitment efforts. The county is even offering a signing bonus. We implemented that a few years ago. The Board of Supervisors provided um, some one-time money to do that, and, um, and we've set it at about 25,000 bucks. So that's a pretty good signing bonus, and we're hoping that it, ha that it produces results, and that is one of the reasons why we um, really shouted that out when uh, uh, we did put that tweet out. Alsop says it's not all about the mandate, but emphasizes there is an option for those who want to make a change. We really wanted to let them know that um, we, there's a place for them here. Uh, we value law enforcement, value them, and we're hiring. Alsop says the communities, the goal is to keep the community safe by putting more officers on the ground. 23ABC also reached out to BPD and CHP about their staffing concerns. We did not hear back from BPD, but CHP says they are also in need of officers. And coming up at 6, we'll have more on how KCSO is combating their staffing issues. Live in Oildale, Taylor Levesque, 23ABC, connecting you.